the day. World, YouTube, Facebook, whatever platform exists in the future where you watch these videos. My name is Trey Jackson. Feel a little chill, late night, slower pace. And this video may be a little scattered, so prepare yourself. Because if you're looking for a quick hit of wisdom, then you know maybe do a quick, different Google search. I don't know. Today is April 20th. Technically, it's 12. My birthday party's tonight. Birthday's tomorrow. Being in your 20s is an interesting thing. You are experiencing the world in a whole new way. Being independent, discovering, exploring, and creating yourself and who you're going to be in the world. Along this journey, you have the, uh, look, typically, not everyone, you might get married, have kids early, whatever, little responsibility. And this is a time where you, I'm still in it, where you, um, you come into yourself. You come into who, like, What's your real expression? What is true for you? How do you navigate the world? What is your, you know, what is your value system? What, what is that rock which you have built your identity on? You know, this is the, you, you get your career and everything together, the foundation. But in this time, you know, you can do much exploring. And there's a societal, you know, blanket of grace for you. You're in your 20s. You're figuring it out. You're, you know, regardless of who might or might not admit it, when you're younger, you're, people understand, you know. I'm going to travel in Europe for three weeks with maybe not sufficient money, whatever. I'm in the 20s. People can get it, all right? When I was in my 40s, all different kinds of judgments. You should be married, you should so and so, my gosh. That's just the way it is. Um, I personally believed, you know, you can live way, way longer. I'm gonna live for at least, at least 150 minimum age. So I'll make like 90, like middle age. So um, anyway, I'm at 70s, middle aged. In this time, it's actually very crucial for you to take advantage of um, just anything you want to do first. Anything you want to do, do it. it, it it'll take some, it might, if you're in your early 20s, it might take some years of confidence to build up to this point to where you're actually able to execute and do it and put yourself out there without you know worrying about what people think or whatever. Once you get there, go hard. If you can cultivate that energy earlier and just start creating something, if I could tell you anything in your early 20s, in your early 20s, just start something to stick with, like five years. Because because when you're early 20s, five years is like literally a whole life. You know, you don't want to, you don't even want to accept. If someone says, hey, stick to this for five years and you'll be in a good place. No, you don't even want to hear that. You want... Instant. If you're listening in your tw early 20s, you want it right now. You want it. You want it. You want it just right now. Right? Six months, maybe three months, you want it. You want to be a legend. You want to be freaking phenom. You want people to say, how do you do that so early? I understand. I understand. You're not the only person that wants it like that. And there's a nature and process and to life. Maybe intentional. But this is your time with little responsibility, with your malleable mind, and you know, you're not so solid, you're not so hardened like some of these old people out here who are like, ah, oh, I've been there, I've done that, oh, I know all about this, I know, you know, I'll never change. You're not, you're, you're, you're bendable like a tree, like a bending tree. 
And it's, it's the great benefit of that is kind of like a baby who is, can shape his head. I'm using my hands a lot today. I can shape the baby's head. And also like, uh, you know, the young child who is impressionable. As far as adults, you're a child, 20s person, in the adult spectrum. It's a beautiful thing, though. Um, that's what I would say. Do stuff that's dangerous, that takes some chances. This is your time. Take advantage of the no response, the little responsibility you have. Set up a project, it's let one fail, do another one. Do whatever excites you, do whatever it is. Like, go travel, seriously, I really mean that because I'm doing it, I'm literally doing it. Only reason I'm telling you. And I heard people say it, but that's the main reason, like do whatever irresponsible thing that you want because this is your chance in time because people are going to literally say that's so irresponsible of you well you know what if you don't do it now what will they say in 10 years then it's really gonna be irresponsible how about 20 years then it's gonna be unacceptable how dare you you're not tw they'll be like you're not in your 20s but you even tell the 20 year old not to, to do it, it because it's too responsible. So 20, 20 year olds go, okay, all right, all right, I won't do it. I'm 20, all right, okay. All right, I'm 30, all right, yeah. What is the end? Everybody's got an opinion, bro. Sis, person, grandma, ma. You all got your opinions, all right? It's great. I'll admit, you know more about life and what is to come, you know, you, you've lived through the stages, all right? You have a certain amount of insight. I cannot, I will not deny that. However, you're not living as this age and this body and this spirit in today's world, and that is just it. So, um, that's what I got to say. The, the, the moral is take advantage of your youth. And youth is also a state of mind. So if you're in your 30s and you're watching this video, which I don't really design this, I don't see 34 year olds watching this channel. If you do, I'm freaking honored. I'm thank you for being here or older. Still do it. You're 30. You're not 60. You're not 80. Because when you're 60 and 80, they're gonna say, "What are you? You're not. You're not 30 years old." You know whatever take advantage age it's been said it's a state of mind what would they say in that book as man thinking ah uh, i'm not gonna mention that i'll just get poetic take advantage of right now because um literally is all you have it's all you have if you don't make plans and set a time to do it today, why will it ever happen? Won't you just be able to use the same excuse for every single year? You know, one day it's going to, you know, one of these days, I think, I heard somebody say, he said, in the next five years, I'm going to do it. How do you know, bro? I was like, I'm traveling to Europe, so and so. He's like 50 something. He's like, I've been wanting to travel to Europe. You know, I might not watch this video, which is, you know. I'm not trying to make fun of you, man. It's just like, in the next five years, when are you going? He might go in the next five years. I don't know. But humans, is not about the person. Humans live in an illusion of someday. Something will happen to where they'll do something different. Like something's going to come into their life. And it may. You know, if you're, if you're very conscious of your thoughts and you know your thoughts create your reality. But you still got to take that action. You still have to take the thought and the opportunity and and act on it these videos of, as of lately have been longer and longer but you know that's what's happening and if you thank you 
for being here. So I really appreciate it. I I'm here for you guys. All right. So do what you want to do. Forget your age. If you're 60. So what? What? What's? 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 So what? Just enjoy yourself. Like it's your life. You know, it's your life. As what is what's the name said? If you haven't had your life, what have you had? All you are is love. Peace of God. All you have right now, it's up to you. Captain of your ship, creator of your world. The, um, I don't know, the queen bee of your hive. Own it, create it, peace.